Hello, I'm Henry DeViller, Product Specialist for SB Armory. In this video, we're going to show you how we take a brand new vehicle and how we create the glass, the Kevlar door panels, and how we design it and get it to you so that you can install it in your customer's car. So, this video is going to be a complete video from the beginning of developing the glass, the panels, how to install it in the car, everything that we have to do. We're going to show you several ways of installing it and how the package arrives to you at your doorstep so that you can install it in your patrol car for your customer. So stay tuned to this video. We're going to show you the complete process on this Dodge Durango. Let's take a look at the door first. In the door you have your glass, okay, and then you have your Kevlar door panels. Sometimes when you're installing the glass, there's modifications that have to be done to the door. The first thing is, is the glass is a lot thicker. You're pulling out a very thin glass, but you're putting in a glass that's a lot thicker. Sometimes we have to take the door apart, which we're going to show you here in just a second, and modify the inside of the door by cutting it on both sides, but sometimes you don't have to do that. Another thing that you have to do is you have to take the molding off of the door, okay, and you have to go inside the door and you have to open it up just a little bit so that it can accommodate that thicker glass. Let's take a look at this. So what you're saying, John, on this particular one, we're not going to have to go in there with a no. socket set and open it up. Most likely not. How about right here? Here, we have to cut here. Right. We have to cut here, and then we, you put your knee here, and you, and you pry it open. You're just going to bend it open. You see how it can bend it? It's, right. This particular car is very weak. So okay. with these two cuts, I'll yeah. just push it and it'll go in. Okay. And this rubber gasket, you take it right there. A piece off. Yeah. Like with the floor, with, with Explorer. All right. So that's it. Okay. So it's quite simple. Okay. So we showed you the glass. Now we're going to show you the Kevlar door panels. In this case, we discovered two options. First of all, you can take the door completely apart and put the glue on it and simply stick the door panels on there, which we're going to show you. Another way of doing it is you open up the door, which you had to do with the glass anyway, and with the glass still in there and the door not taken apart, we're going to drop the panels in there. We're going to drop the lower panel first, fix it to the door skin that has glue on it already, and then we're going to do the second one. We're going to show you how we design the glass. First, we take the glass out of the car completely around. Then what we have to do is we have to measure the glass, the dimensions of the glass. Then we have to take the curvature. Now, we have some steel molds here that are the curvature of the glass. When we start, we put flat glass on it, and as we put it in the ovens, it curves. Here's some video of it. We're going to show you the ovens. We're going to show you the molds. We're going to show you the glass and the actual process of how we're making the glass. These ovens heat up very, very hot. Now it's very important because we do the cat glass and we do the polycarbonate, we do it separate. And then we have to affix it. We have what we call a clean room where all this is done. Once the glass is done, we have to go around the edges, we have to clean it up, we have to polish the glass and prepare it for the customer, then we cover it and then we ship it to you. In armoring a door, you have to look at two possibilities. First of all, you may be using uh, material like Kevlar, Toron combination, or ultra hard steel. In the case of the Dodge Durango, we made molds for both. Now we're going to show you the Kevlar molds that we make. The good news is the Dodge Durango is fairly easy. If there's a lot of curvature to the door, a lot of obstacles to the door, what we have to do is make a fiberglass mold and then we have to press the Kevlar and then we have to cut it. Now that holds true with the steel also. We have to make it so that it fits into the door and sometimes we have to make multiple pieces. In this situation, we made two pieces for the Dodge Durango and we made it flat and we made it where it just drops right in. Now, this Melspec Kevlar is flat, however, when it goes into the door, it simply pushes into place and it glues into place. Now we have everything that we need to make production products, the glass, the Kevlar panels, and the steel panels so that we can send it to you. 
When it comes to you, it comes in a wooden crate. Okay, this is shipped various various forms, various ways, but it'll come to you with the glass and the Kevlar panels or the steel panels already all included in the same kit. Now, depending on your customer and what their level of uh, protection level they're asking, you want to go ahead and specify the protection level that you want. If you're using glass, if you want a special tint on it, okay, we'll put the tint. Another thing that we do is we place the labels so that it's easy visible. If you take a door panel, you can see what you have in there. And we're going to put your company logo on the glass. That way, later on out in the field, if there's a problem with the glass, the customer can take a look at it. He can say, this glass was purchased from this company. I know who to contact. Let's say if they need a replacement piece of glass or whatever the case might be.